Add to that its effective nameplate, Nord Super Deluxe. It has graceful artistic lettering and brilliant chrome finish. Then, notice the perfect flowing functional design of the laser latch opening device. Yes, it's a refrigerator which combines smoothness, extreme simplicity of flowing line, and yet a kind of luxurious richness. It's a unit which will add beauty to any kitchen. And even the experts are convinced. Art experts from the Albright Gallery in Buffalo, New York, toured the whole country in search of home appliances which had outstanding functional beauty. And here is their verdict. They chose Norge. They did because it is an outstanding example of beauty and function combined. If anything, the new model... Well, Doctor, my resistance began to weaken. You know how susceptible to beauty women are. Yes, my dear, I do. But I also taught you that function, function is the vital thing to look for. Yes, you did. That's why I wish you'd heard him describe the self-defroster. It has a function which any woman appreciates. Oh, if you'd only heard him, you'd understand why it held me so. He said... You may think this is just a timepiece. Actually, it's a device which saves you time. Time, money, labor, trouble. It's a feature exclusive to Norge. The Norge self-defroster. I don't understand. You mean it works automatically? Yes, ma'am. And it's the only one that does. Here, let me show you. It turns off the refrigerator every midnight while you're asleep. The freezer defrosts, and then automatically refrigeration begins again. Well, doesn't water spill all over meats and food? I always have to remove them now, otherwise they get soaked. I'm glad you said that. Notice. Ice cubes and frozen foods in the sealed freezer remain frozen, and meat in the cold pack does not have to be removed. Nothing need be removed because, since there is a nightly defrost, very little, practically no frost develops on the freezer. That means only a little water flows from it. That small amount of water is caught in this tray. Notice how it protects the cold pack, nor will the water overflow. The tray allows the water to flow directly into the handy froster, which catches the entire flow right here. It need be removed only when necessary. And that's so simple. Unlike the old type tray, there's little chance of spilling water all over the kitchen. It's safe and easy to empty. Now, self-defroster does save you time and labor, doesn't it? It certainly does. Well, it'll save you money, too, by saving electric current. Tell me, does your old freezer accumulate much frost? Oh, yes. I have to defrost about every three days. Well, that's too bad. You see, experiments prove that frost insulates the freezer and so kills its chilling effect that it takes much more current to do its job. How much more? Records prove that one-eighth of an inch of frost has the same insulating effect as one inch of rubber or three inches of granite. That gives you some idea of how much more current is needed. Whereas the self-defroster keeps frost paper thin, lets the freezer work with top efficiency and minimum current. That saves you money. So does the fact that you no longer have to keep the door open when you defrost. That open door allows warm air to rush in and it takes a lot of current to cool it again. But automatic defrosting is done behind a closed door. The air stays cool and a tiny bit of current brings it back to normal. Now, isn't that top efficiency? Well, Doctor, isn't it top efficiency? Do you think my favorable reaction is abnormal? My dear, I haven't seen you for five years, as you remember. I must know every detail before I express an opinion. Please go on. All right. I had never thought of a freezer as a place to store much. Yes, the Norge Safety Seal Freezer was lovely to look at. Perfect in structure and design. 
But when he told me it would hold 37 pounds of frozen food, I didn't believe it. Sensing my doubt, he put a photograph before it to show its possible contents. Frozen foods, ice cubes, desserts, and so on. Certainly not 37 pounds. I just didn't believe it and told him just that. But hearing my disbelief, he did something amazing. You have every right to doubt, ma'am. It does seem incredible. But let me show you the dishes prepared from only 28 one-pound packages of frozen food taken from a freezer of this size. Well, I held one end of it, and he began to move away. The result was staggering. These dishes were prepared from only 28 one-pound packages of frozen food, on my word. It's still incredible, but I believe it now. Having proved that, he continued. Yes, it has enormous capacity. And notice how it's built. The freezer body is of the sealed tank type. Nothing can enter it or escape from its rear, its sides, top or bottom. Add to that, these live rubber gaskets between the door and the freezer. You'll find that when these doors are closed, they do more than block the view. Firmly closed by a spring clip, they cause the whole freezer to be sealed tight. No heat can enter it, no cold can escape. This not only makes for economy, it does more. Air, you know, carries moisture. The fact that this freezer is sealed tight keeps its interior frostless. The lack of frost makes the ice trays easily movable. They never stick. The air also carries odors from other foods. The tight seal prevents those odors from entering the freezer and tainting your ice cubes. The cubes are always usable. Then, doctor, he summarized. The long side freezer had an enormous capacity. The fact that it was sealed made it efficient, economical, frostless, and odorless. Doctor, you say function is the vital thing. Oh, certainly you agree that the self-defroster and the sealed freezer do an outstanding job. Don't they justify my wish to buy? Not quite, my dear. There are many other factors to consider. For instance, this freezer seems so large that I imagine it kills shelf space which is also vital. <laughs> oh, Doctor, you're so wrong. He began his shelf demonstration with a photograph showing their capacity. Again, I was impressed. But when he claimed the bottle shelf would hold a whole case of bottles, I followed your training. A whole case of bottles? That seems unlikely. It does, doesn't it? Let me show you. Certainly this is equal to a case, isn't it? And it holds the usual variety, all arranged in life size. Now watch carefully. He certainly did prove his point. What's more, an opening in the top shelf gave room to the tallest bottles. And yes, even the shelf structure was highly flexible. For example, if all bottles were tall, the top shelf was movable room could be made to fit. Matter of fact, most of the shelves were adjustable. It seems that the entire space could be fitted to your needs. Yes, doctor, function, function. And, as he said... This chrome edge not only gives a rich appearance, ma'am, it also prevents items from slipping out. I hope you've noticed that in the Nords, beauty and function are a faithful married couple. They always go hand in hand. But let me give you another example. This ribbed glass shelf is certainly attractive, isn't it? But it also has a very important job. It concentrates all moisture inside the vegetable crisper. As you know, vegetables and greens need moisture to stay crisp. The crisper is roomy, too. Many refrigerators have one or two half-width drawers, drawers not big enough to hold long rhubarb or celery stalks. This photo shows you how this full-width crisper is big enough and wide enough to hold anything. Now, isn't it true that while many things don't need cold storage, you still like to keep them close to the refrigerator? 
true with me. It's true with most women. And this photo proves the answer. The Ruby Tiltabin for dry storage. Things like cornflakes, canned foods, and staples have a perfect home here. Not to mention bananas. Useful, isn't it? I mean the tilde bin. Yes, it is. At this point, Doctor, all my resistance had almost vanished. My only salvation was to run out, but he firmly held my attention. Everything was so perfect. The laser latch. To open the door, you can either pull it, or if your hands are full, you can push it. The lightest touch opens the door. The nine-point control. It gives a wide range of temperatures to meet any conceivable need. The inside door panel, lined with Norgite, a thing very durable and easy to clean. He assured me that the old familiar rust streak, usually found at the lower edge, was eliminated by an air-conditioned door. A series of openings drew out all air before the moisture in it could condense, drip, and rust the lower edge. A beautiful, clean thing and easy to keep clean. It has curved corners and very few screws and dirt-catching joints. A cleaning cloth will slide smoothly over every part. Then, Doctor, he showed me something which brought my resistance down to zero. In his hand, he held what seemed to be a jewel box. He said, Here is the heart of a Nord's refrigerator. The device that makes cold air out of warm air. The rolling. Notice, including the shaft, it has only three parts, each made to watch like precision. We have such confidence in it that we guarantee it for five years. How soon do you want it delivered, ma'am? I wanted to say right now, but instead I ran out. I remembered your warnings, your training, the old illness that you cured me of. I ran out. I got here in 15 minutes. Here I am. Doctor, for the first time in five years, I want to buy. All you have to do is assure me that my reaction is normal. Please do. My dear, do you think it's normal to neglect vital mechanical details? You of all people should know that normal women don't care about mechanical details. No, they don't. And it's a pity. Come, take me to this place and I'll prove your neglect of vital things. I'll show you. Well, in about 20 minutes, they got there. Naturally, the doctor had a man's point of view, so our perfect salesman changed his tactics to nuts and bolts. He began by telling him the story of Norge cabinet construction, explaining how it seals in the cold and keeps out the heat. Listen. So we have a jointless sealed unit. Now, to maintain that sealed quality, the door and box contact is made airtight by a live rubber gasket. The total result is a perfectly sealed unit. Airtight, yes. But as you know or should know, no matter how airtight a thing is, heat and cold can still travel through metal. You're perfectly right. That's why we use fiberglass insulation, the finest in the industry. In the Norge, a six-inch bat of this fiberglass is compressed to three and a half inches between the metal sheets. There is practically no contact between the inside and outside metal. So, the heat stays out, the cold stays in. Quite efficient. And so the perfect salesman continued. He knew all mechanical details and was prepared to demonstrate. Just watch. Of course, Doctor, we don't use cigarette smoke. We use Freon refrigerant, which is harmless, colorless, and odorless. But watch how the rollator works. Suction and compression go on at the same time. Suction below the dividing blade, compression above it. The compressed Freon is fed through this port to the condenser. Yet, below the roller, a new draft of Freon has been drawn in. And notice that there is no metal-to-metal -metal contact. A thin oil film separates one section from the other. And the motion is so slow and smooth, the roll later will last for years. Here.
Looks like a toy, young man, just a toy. Yes, it does. But mechanical experts have chosen the rollator to exhibit with other fine precision-built mechanisms. A very early model is now in Henry Ford's Greenfield Village Museum. And here, here is a 1929 model which has given the equivalent of 70 years of household operation. And it's still running. So just imagine how efficient the newest versions are. And so the perfect salesman used every device available to convince the skeptical. And when he was done, the doctor probed his expert mind to find some objection no salesman could answer. There must be one. But no, here was a line with enough variety to satisfy all tastes and all needs. Here, here was such perfect design that the most critical men, art experts, gave it the highest award. And in addition to functional beauty, here was mechanical perfection. The heart of a Norge, the Rollator, was chosen by mechanical experts as an example of top efficiency. But suddenly, suddenly the doctor found a perfect objection. Price. Price. Certainly an appliance that perfect must, must have a fantastic price. A price only the rich could pay. He took the salesman aside and asked the vital question. The price quoted left him no choice. A scientist must always give a fair verdict. He said, My dear, here's my verdict. You are quite normal. Matter of fact, the product, its price, and the salesman make a perfect combination. So you'd better buy. I'll think you're abnormal if you don't. Yes, and the minute Mrs. Stewart was through giving her order, the doctor stepped up. He said, young man, I'm normal, always have been. So, I want one too. Yeah.